So for such a popular chief minister, many would ask, why is he then allying with the BJP? When what is this pressing compulsion? Never, I don't think in Indian politics you have seen an alliance between a ruling party and the main opposition party. So something must have happened. Okay. Um, why somebody joins an alliance? Somebody joins an alliance because they want to win elections. Somebody joins an alliance because they want to have an impact in the electoral math. Here is a chief minister who is so popular in the state and he gets three-fourth majority every time, Mr. Navin Patnaik. The recently concluded panchayat elections, he won symbol election. It's based on party symbol. He won 90% of the seats. And uh, the second party was 5% seats, BJP. So Mr. Navin Patnaik doesn't need an alliance to come back to serve the people. He doesn't need an alliance. You're saying I, BJP needs I, an alliance. No, I would say the same thing about Mr. Narendra Modi, the Honorable Prime Minister of India. Whatever surveys you are showing, whatever others are showing, that he is going to become the Prime Minister of the country. Mr. Navin Patnaik is going to the Chief Minister of the state, undoubtedly, and Mr. Navin, Mr. Narendra Modi is going to be the Prime Minister. How I put it is, it is beyond. There are some things beyond politics. It is a mark of great statesmanship. That's how I put it. That two great leaders wanting to come together for a greater cause. It, it, it has, it has, it has significance as two two great uh, people coming together as as a mark of statesmanship. It has nothing to do with politics. That's how I see it. That's how I put it. And even the chief minister thinks that way. So you said in the it has no pull, it has no electoral value either for BJP or for BJD. No, you, uh, earlier in the first part of the answer, you said why do parties align with each other? They want to win elections. They want to change the electoral map. So is it that BJP needs BJD more or BJD needs BJP more? It, uh, BJP doesn't need uh, B, BJD doesn't need BJP to form government in the state, and BJP may not need BJD to form government in the center. That's why I made it very clear that. It is to do with two individuals who share a great friendship amongst each other and they see some things are beyond politics and that is where you see a rare mark of uh, statesmanship. I consciously use the word statesmanship. It is nothing to do with politics. It's beyond politics. So, so where is the status of that alliance right now? Because PM came, I think, earlier this month. He pra praised Naveen Patnaik as a Lokpriya Neta. But we haven't heard anything ever since. I think if anything happens, we'll all get to know. No, no, that's why I'm asking you. <laughs> no, no, better to ask I, than you. We'll all get to know if something happens. But I, I, I told the logic behind this, whatever talk has happened also, I told the logic behind. It has nothing of electoral significance either to Odisha or to the country. It is more to do with statesmanship. Okay. Talking about statesmanship, clearly Naveen Babu is a statesman in his own right. Like I said, he has already gone past Jyoti Basu's record. Uh, and if he wins this election, which, like you said, is almost a certainty, he will become the longest-serving chief minister in the history of India. Uh, we have called this session...